many educators use Google Forms for formative and summative assessments? And I want to show you today how you can allow students to retake one of those assessments um, and not have to do much work on your end. So this was my assessment right here. And let me just show you how I had it set up. So I'm going to go up into the settings, the little gear wheel. I designed it to collect the email addresses so that I wouldn't need names. Uh, I restricted it to my school district and I limited them to one response. I did not allow editing after submitting. Under the presentation, I chose not to shuffle my question order, but for a retake, I might want to do that. Um, and then under quizzes, I added the grading portion into my Google Form. So I'm gonna, I saved it, so I don't need to resave it right there. You'll notice I did take it once to practice, didn't do very well, and I built in to my quiz um, some feedback. And so I would hope that the students would go ahead and take some of that feedback and learn from it and be able to retake it and do better. Now before they can retake it, I need to go to responses and I can go to the individual and I could go ahead, if you have multiple ones, you can delete a particular student's score. Like let's say, okay, um, Cheryl Wilson, I knew that she studied now. She can go ahead and retake it. I'm going to go ahead and get rid of this response of hers. It says it's going to be, okay. So now, um, if I click on my spreadsheet, you're going to notice that that's what I have recorded on there. So I'm going to go back here um, and we're going to preview it. Now I'm the one that's logged in so that's why it's going to prompt me and it will allow me now because I deleted the first response to take it again. I'm going to go ahead and say hour four. Let's say I'd watched it and now I know, okay, I have that and now I know that this is negative one and I'm going to submit it and I can view my score here. Didn't score that, but I got that right and I got that right now. Much, much better. Um, so on the teacher spreadsheet, you're going to notice it kept the person's name. It did switch it. So it went ahead and updated that grade uh, for me. So that is a way that you can have students retake tests or quizzes on Google Forms.